Hi guys. <laughs> Welcome to my third video. <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's been a journey. It hasn't been easy, guys. I promise you, I will get better. Like, take me, because I have not been consistent. I'm so sorry. And I want to be consistent. Pro I promise you, I want to be consistent. It's like so, like life and everything, but this is like... Uh, one of like this is like almost like a passion project to me This is something that I'm super passionate about and this is something that I really want to accomplish in life And something that I've been talking to like a lot of my friends about for years starting a YouTube channel And now that I'm finally like I finally have one and I have videos up and I have subscribers Like I have 155 that's like crazy to me Like 155 people are watching me 155 people like are like hey like let me click on Jacob's video Let's see what he's up to. And comment. Even if it's not about the video, comment. Comment about how your day went. Comment about anything because I want to know what's going on in your life. I love all 155 of you guys. And I just want to do better for myself and for you guys first and foremost. And I'll do better. And I'll be more consistent. Trust me. Anyways. But after hearing that whole spiel... I know that you guys are wondering like what this video is going to be today or what what is this video going to be about um, It's not going to be a makeup video or it's not going to be it's not a vlog or it's not a story time or anything It's going to be a reaction video um, It's going to be a reaction to a K-pop group If you don't like K-pop mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> mm -mm. Stay Just feel it out like, give it a listen, just watch my video, and you might like it. If you don't, you know, nothing against you. It's like, to each their own with the music we all like. So, the K-pop group I'm going to be reacting to is G-Idol, their new comeback, Queen Card. I'm really excited because on like I'm not even gonna lie on TikTok. I see like because I follow them on TikTok. On TikTok, I see like a bunch of their videos like, I am your Queen Card. You know what I mean? Like, it's just like. They're, when I tell you they're iconic, they're, they're like, they give me like, they give me like, like, I don't even want to say the word because I don't, you know. That this bitch really fucking this shit up! It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. And I just noticed <laughs> my drawer. That's how you know it's life, y'all. That's how you know it's real life up in here. Anyways, but yes, I'm excited to watch this video and to see what they're about because I've seen videos of them because I've, I l usually listen to their, their title tracks and like their main comeback songs, but um, I'm really excited for this one because I feel like this one is like something I've never heard from a lot of K-pop groups. This is something like just different. It's like, to me, it's like very camp. So I'm excited. Let's give it a listen. I just I had this discussion with one of my friends. I love how they um, add and they include like different ethnicities in the video. It's not like it's not just the group or it's like you know I love how they add like different people of color in K-pop videos nowadays. I think it's like one. I think it opens the door for like possibilities of different non-korean or non-asian k-pop idols which i think is super cool um i know that there's like black swan we had alex reed and stuff like that and like obviously currently there's black swan thought too that's my girl period i love her that's my bias on black swan i don't listen to them but that's my girl right there but i love how they add like non-korean people of color in the in the video I just love it, and I love it so much. Let's get back to the video though. 
Oh, Mion is so pretty. She's so, oh my god, look, Minnie. That's my bias. Minnie's my girl. I love that. Okay, I love that party scene. Okay, I know this part. I like that part. Are they gonna give me like a white chicks moment? Is it like this isn't the white chicks dance battle? You girls want some of this? Okay, they give me white chicks dance battle. <laughs> they give me white chicks dance battle. Not Kim! Not Kim Kat! Oh, okay, my girl, Ariana. That's my girl right there. Okay, can we talk about- Okay, can we talk about Shua? Shuha? Really quick? Because even though she gets, like, three lines in the whole song, I honestly believe those three lines have an impact, and two, she is, like, the visual of visuals. And, and a lot of she is so pretty. I don't even know if she's an official visual. She's a visual to me. She's so gorgeous. She's so pretty. Like, uh, just she's so pretty in so many like, in so many ways. She is so pretty. Like her hair, her face, her personality. She's funny. Just the way that she dances. Like she's just so pretty. Her cheekbones. Like, oh, she's so pretty. Like I just love her. She's so like dainty, you know what I mean? I just ugh, love her. See, look at me. Okay, not them dancing in the doctor. Just said we're going to do surgery. Period. Surgery. surgery. Oh, oh. She's another one that's like it's giving me a girl like clueless vibes. Where are you going? See, this is what I'm talking about. Can we go back and look at her face? Look at her face! You cannot tell me that she's not gorgeous. And I know this is obviously not Shuha. This is not. This is uh, Soyun. I know she's so pretty. Um, all of them are just so pretty. Like, they're just all so gorgeous. How do y'all? They're so pretty. Like, I know I'm, you know, but they're just so pretty. Oh my god, they're so gorgeous. And they like, she can rap. And like, if you look at the, they have like almost for every one of their comebacks, they have like a behind the scenes of them recording. She's the, she, she produces and she writes. Like, She's a hella good producer. Like, she instructs them lyric by lyric. Hey, this is what we're doing. This is how I want you to sound. How, want you to sound it out. This is how I want it to sound in general. If you don't get it here, okay, we'll do it again, do it again, do it again. But, like, she does it all. She's, like, looks, vocals, rap, writing, production. Like, everything visual. Like, she's so talented, multifaceted. Oh, my God. She's killer. Everything. Love her. This song. I told you, it's a little, it's camp. It's working on the runway. Girl, you could twerk. Here, see? This dress has been everywhere. The buckle dress. Oh my god. I love this. I love the outfits. She's so pretty. It's giving like Dr. Cream drama. <laughs> No, girl, you don't need surgery. You don't need it. And that's what she's probably saying. I love her. See, she's like, no. Ooh, stop. Halt. Oh, my God. Low rise. I could ever. One day. <laughs> she's so pretty. Oh, my God. She's so gorgeous. Even when she's, like, trying to not even be pretty, and she's just trying to be, like, you know, whatever. No, she's so gorgeous. I feel you, girl. I feel you.
period, y'all. I have nothing to say. Like, I probably like G Idol is that for me. G Idol is one of those groups where like they can do something like La Tata, like their debut, where it's like very like different. It's like mystical. Or they can do something like. Let me look up their songs. Or they can do something like Tomboy. Oh my god, Tomboy. Or they could do something like Hua, like I love Hua or Han, you know, or Nude. Like, bruh, I'm telling you, they can do a lot. Like, they are so good. Senorita, okay, can we talk about something really quick? And I just have to get this off my chest. You're probably already getting what I'm saying. Sujin. Am I the only one that misses her? Like, I think that those bullying accusations were proved wrong, right? See, what I'm gonna need, I have a plan. I can't say it though. I have a plan. Not a plan, but I have like, you know, if I was a, if I was their manager, or if I was somebody that knew them, I would be talking to them like, so this is what we gotta do. Because I need my girl Sweden back. I need her back. I need her back in action, back in the forefront. Cause she was, she was that girl. She was like that girl. G Idol for me, they're a good group. I love them as a group in general. They're amazing. Like they're they're that group. Like I was saying, for this song for Queen Card, it's so good. Like I honestly think that this is like a really good song. I'm sorry, like this is like No, they can't. They like They can't do no wrong. And this is the, oh, they have us. <sighs> they have a song called Allergy. Is that why I said I feel allergy? Because that's like one of the tracks. Oh, wow. I didn't know that. Okay, that's cute. That's cute. That's cute. I like that. I really... I loved it. I loved it. It was like the moments when they were like the pink, the pink dresses. Oh, my God. Those were giving. The pink dresses. The visuals, the makeup. Like the white chicks dance party scene. Like when they were having a dance battle. It's like... I'm a queen car, I'm a queen car, period. You know what I mean? Like, they were having a dance battle. I'm like, girl, you gonna dance battle? I'm a dance battle, you back, period. I'm like, I'm in the dance battle with them. Like, put me in the fucking video. Put me in the camera. <laughs> but I loved it. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. The only thing I'll give them is they needed me in the video because I'll be in the back like, I'm a queen car, I'm a queen car, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a queen car. What it is, ho, what's up? Every good girl 